Hello, it is I, the King of Spicy, on my never-ending quest to devour and conquer the spiciest foods in all the realm. It is May 2020, and as some of you may not know, the month of May is National Salsa Month. And today I have with me K. John's Carolina Reaper Salsa. Very excited about this. I have not yet had Carolina Reaper Salsa. I got this from mojadamobetta.com. Got a lot of spicy products on that website. Go check them out. The ingredients in this salsa are tomatoes, jalapenos, onions, super habaneros, Carolina Reapers, vinegar, tomato paste, garlic, salt, and black pepper. Looks pretty chunky to me. Not a runny sauce. Looks pretty good. So. Without further ado, give me some corn chips. Can't have salsa without corn chips, right? The battle! Ooh, you can definitely smell them Reapers in there, definitely. Oh, yeah. I'm excited. Mm. Mm. Wow. A little bit on the sweet side. You got the sweetness first. And then the heat comes. Back when I was a young prince of spicy, I used to be intimidated by the vegetables in the salsa. I used to just dip the toe of the chip like so. I used to just dip it, make sure there's nothing on there. That was chunky and unappealing. But today, I declare it spicy, and I eat everything inside of the salsa. Pretty good. Got some heat in there. It's not too overwhelming. But why don't we kick it up a notch with some pocky ghost pepper chips? Declare it spicy. Here we are. A nice one. Now let's see if these uh, ghost pepper chips increase the flames. It's too bad. Mm. Mm. Very good. Definitely increases it. Doing the mouth burn. Oh yeah. Mm. So there you go. Remember to always do a five minute afterburn. Echo, five minutes on the clock. Five minutes, five minutes. All right. It's a good burn.
nice heat. Heat doesn't seem to be rising, so I'm gonna have some guests that just pulled up actually, so I'm gonna have to cancel the five minute afterburn. The heat really isn't rising, it just stays there. It's pretty good. So remember to like and subscribe, and always declare it spicy.